you great people of god i welcome you all in the name of jesus you are welcome to this awesome session god bless you praise the lord my name is awanga iris and this is the atmosphere of possibilities thank you so much for joining this amazing family god bless you praise the lord hallelujah if you're new i welcome you in the name of jesus if you're old thank you for always coming back god bless you praise the lord hallelujah you attracted a curse from the day you offered this word, from the day you removed your eyes from God and put in a man. You attracted a curse from that day you removed your eye from, him, from God and put it in a man. Talking about you remove your eye, you looking up to God. You turn your back and start looking up to man. Man will feel, but God will never feel you. Jeremiah 17 verse 5 says, Curse be upon a man that puts his trust in a man. That was a scripture for us. We should not trust in man, we should trust in God, who is the author and the finisher of every good things we are expecting God to do for us here on earth. So if you're out there, you're trusting in a man, you are cursing your own self. You're cursing your own self because man will fail you. Man will disappoint you. But whenever you trust in God, you can never be disappointed. Whenever you trust in God, everything will work together for your good. Whenever you trust in God, you will receive the crown of righteousness. I pray for you on that grace. May God set you free. Wherever you have deposited your trust, may God help you. Remove your trust from man and put back to him in the mighty name of Jesus. May God give you another chance. May God favor you and may God see you through in Jesus mighty name amen now may the Lord bless you may he keep you may the Lord cause his countenance to shine on you may the Lord be gracious to you and may the Lord give you peace the shalom of the Lord nothing missing nothing broken I love you great people of God and I will see you in our next session God bless you shalom